Hi there. Um, right, we're going to do a week and draw an hour at time now. I'm just going to shuffle these a couple of times and then we'll split the pack and see where it ends up. And then we'll read to that person. Okay, okay right, Capricorn, you're on. Could be dealing with a cancer, Capricorn. But yeah, we're going to deal with you first. Um, So Capricorn, 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 right, we're going to do a, a card reading, so it can be about anything, it's going to be for the last part of November, so any cards that come out, um, and right this minute you could be dealing with a cancer, Conflict and defeat with somebody, and now you're having passion ignited. So let's have a look first of all at this conflict and defeat. Yeah, you were looking to get recognition and reward in the situation. Um, a couple more of these more blessings right away. Yeah. Maybe you or your person had some movement and choices um, and somebody had to choose wisely. Yeah, you felt like there were some illusions and lies around you, but maybe you went to sleep in the moon for a little while. And maybe there's some gossip that was going on um, and causing you a lot of stress. Maybe you were up at night times. Maybe you felt this person should have been your support, your home. Could have definitely been a cancer, but maybe you felt like they moved away from you. So, yeah, Robin. Yeah, and the transportation, so someone moved away from you. Yeah, at least you felt emotionally someone moved away from you, Capricorn. Yeah, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Cusp. Could have involved, don't be stupid, and new moon and sad to be up, could be on your side. You could be dealing with a hermit, the Vir Virgo at this time. And a Leo sun. Somebody's got no control at this time. So that way the passion ignite can't be mm. yeah. Leo Virgo Cup. You could be doing definitely dealing with Leo and a Virgo Capricorn. Someone could have native American blood and this person is a reptile, yeah. And you could need to go to the countryside and a musical moon, nothing is set in stone. So we'll have a look, see who you're having this new Passion ignited when I saw that. You feel it's guided by the universe. You feel like you took solitude and then you got harmony. But look at their faces, it's sarcasm in their harmony, Capricorn. It's not, it's not real. Yeah, and you may be hanging around waiting a lot on this situation. Some of you feel very karmic already, and you could know that. You could be feeling that, Capricorn. What's this waiting down about? We've got King of Cups here. He looks very dominant in this situation. And maybe he's gone to get and find balance. Maybe he found balance with someone else. Maybe you were ignoring you know, 
when he's loving you and, and maybe you were looking at your other ships coming in and somebody else and maybe maybe there is a Leo involved because there's a Leo there with the same man that you're meeting in, on the site yeah and maybe you put someone in the hangman situation where they don't know how to move forward but you don't realize about this person they Capricorn is that they do this to a lot of people and they cause a lot of endless cycles with people that are together already and they bathe people in they end up <laughs> she's bathing in blood she's in a blood bath and uh, there's like five women already and we only pulled I think six cards in anyways let's carry on <laughs> Each tier I am. The letter M could be relevant and trust no one. It's so low all the way. Captain. Be very careful what you do and who you're letting in your life. Cut a course meditation on the letter N. And here's that peeping in the window. Somebody either peeps in Dom, somebody watches you. Erectile dysfunction. There's a lot of hidden fucks by these big gods. Mistress. Anal weeds. This person could just seem very exciting compared to what you are. Yeah, oh, to be popular just like them. Gaslight, then Gemini Moon, Scorpio Ascendant, and their skin penniless. They could be taking your money. Aries Sun could be involved in some way or another. This person's wishing bad on you. Yeah, they're evil. And um, this person needs to grow up. A dark witch could be up involved and the sound of the police. Yeah, you need to release all these things, people or all these things, Capricorn. Yeah. <clears throat> you could have, be feeling like you're having a positive move forward and having a lot of patience in the situation. You could be quite discontent and bored, really. So what keeps you there? Yeah, truth. Maybe you got told the truth of your person. Maybe that caused you disruption and the end of a foundation, the end of, of uh, achievements and foundation and rejoicing in celebration with somebody. Maybe you and somebody fell out of love. I don't know. Someone fell out of love with you. You felt like you were constantly pushing dark clouds and the light clouds, maybe. Yeah, maybe you got on your ship or somebody else got on their ship and maybe someone cut and cleared, you know, harvested what they produced. Time's ticking on that situation. Someone's being very two-faced though. Someone may feel lucky at this time with another man, with the other man, yeah, because there is another woman. So with the other man comes another woman. Remember that, yeah. And there's you, Capricorn, the married woman. I don't know where your husband is though, yeah, and there is you having lots of stress and anxiety and worry over this other man and who they else they have. Yeah, something could be becoming a bit old, a bit elderly, something to have to do with sexuality with. Yeah, something needs to come to an end, they want a home situation, something you took a gamble in Capricorn. Because it all could be about to backfire, but yeah you come into some awareness or somebody has um and there isn't even time to have rest or rejuvenation you need to use your intuition at this time yeah because your destiny could be affected so you could be suffering in silence and trapped in fear over the situation you haven't got any strict spiritual strength in the situation either it's disabling you in some way Capricorn. Yeah, you, your own family could have cursed you or you them. And they're the most foul. Someone that's unreliable and useless. You can't rely on them for anything. Something about somebody's family and somebody was going to be drowned. Like this disgust. A cold hearted person, dead person. Libra Sun could be involved in the situation. Scorpio Moon, a male friend, never, never, a letter E, a sassy black woman, and a Gemini son. So, Capricorn.
Pull that, pull that home. You know, talk about your feelings. A chance to start again. Hello and goodbye. You soon see that this change will make things better. Very soon what you're asking for is going to happen. And a love jackpot. So what's Capricorn's love jackpot about? Who's in the love jackpot? Oh, okay. We've got one. Right. You've got a queen of wands. You've got a Leo in here. Someone who's shining a light on the situation. She can be very psychic as well, Queen of Wands comes out. So anything else? Leo is Leo, Capricorn. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. Yeah, you've got a soulmate involved here, or at least what you consider to be a soulmate. Something you quite like to have a relationship with. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, you could have a lot of that in their chart. You've been enlightened to a situation, you're now coming out of the hangman, so now you're facing the right way up, Capricorn. What are you going to do? Yeah, you could also be pregnant. You could be an older person who's pregnant. There could be a pregnancy here, and you could be having illusions and lies over that situation, because you could even be in a higher level of commitment. You may get a message from an earth sign, or you may send one. Somebody, this earth sign could be connected, though. It could be very uh, powerful. Yeah, you could be having an ending somewhere. Somebody wants justice there and they've got blood in that now. Yeah, they want to drop burdens, burn burdens. That could be a Leo. A Leo could be burden, burn, burden, <laughs> burning. Bridges with you, Capricorn, maybe. Why have we got the sun card and the burden? Yeah, someone had a vision. And took back their control, maybe, in a situation, yeah, in a situation where they could have been feeling two apart, so that could have been you, and yeah, someone's been hanging on to a while, having a prophecy, and they just like, and they saw the theft, they saw a theft, could have been a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, but they took independence back, and they had resolution, even if it was on their own, yeah, this could have been a friendship, uh, and it could have been something you had a lot of preparation and you could have planned to do this to somebody, Capricorn. Yeah, went off and had a new beginning, dropped your burden. And then got pregnant with that angel of abundance. And yeah, you need to hear your sacred chakra. Person's spell work meant for somebody and got a child and say plotting to rob you and doing the runner. Maybe you're going to do a runner with this lover and have a baby. Hmm. Yeah, you could be passionately messaging this person at the moment. Yeah, maybe this person and you passionately, somebody passionately meant their messages lots of people. Yeah. And they have lots of one night stands, and there's a truth coming out to this situation because maybe at the moment, Capricorn is dancing above the clouds. Somebody's got you floating. Yeah, three of cups. They're also very good at juggling. They have lots of choices, or you do, but I have a feeling it might be them. Yeah. You're not drowning anymore with your soulmate, though, so you come to think, uh, a change there. That could have been a cancer. The letter H could be relevant, someone could use Viagra, a car crash could happen, the letter I, a big family feud could about to take place, and someone's going to be a very unstable person. Eurogenesis, which is the influence in electric, still being a virgin or acting like it. Someone wants to come correct now, homeless people, Virgo, Moon, and January could be relevant, Scientology, an endless stream of diarrhea. Heart chakra, emotions, August could be relevant. You could start something in August, shape shift it, refocus and step over the shit, and meet people, have plans together on you. Keep on the low. This third person talks out of the ball. Yeah, whatever they tell you is a load of rubbish. They don't remember anyway, they're probably drunk. Yeah, it causes you a fire. Fuck up, fuck, fuck up. These secrets are coming out and they're going to break your heart. Hex cares return to centre. July also could be relevant. Player when you know it. Something's very karmic. This person's totally lost a plot. Somebody's married. November's relevant. Pyrogenesis. The Pope and 
They want to call you. Someone's fucking with your card, more than likely, and someone knows about hidden money. Aquarius moon. Waking up half naked in the car park. And someone writes counterfeits. They can't handle your things and messing with your energy. Someone don't want you going nowhere. November's relevant. Something could be happening this month. This person catches people in the the letter J. And this person having sex with you to take your money, Capricorn. Bit of slap and tickle, you know. They could be from abroad. And your person, the one doing the black magic, yeah. You are a powerful light worker, the letter B could be relevant. Ain't had stuff. That's sex, death, letting go, regeneration, sharing, death, rebirth, Scorpio, Pluto, Phoenix, rising from the ashes, side piece. You know it, you know it. This person needed time, so someone lied about pregnancy. An ex friend is fucking your ex and lying about it. Being rich, Sagittarius moon. They spend more time watching you than getting on with their own lives. Somebody watching, watching, watching. A lot of dads to a child, for everything a child. Dream telepathy. And they don't realise you ain't ever, yeah, ever. What's love got to do with it? Taurus and um, somebody could be hearing screams. And they're clueless to a situation. D could be relevant. Somebody could have AIDS, so you need to be careful who you have sex with Capricorn. Make sure you know what they're doing and who they sleep with. I don't think that would be possible, though. If you look on their Facebook, you're a bit of cold. Menstrual rage, voodoo sex cells, anything you put on me, I put back on you. Evil eyes. And yeah, an STD ridden sex addict on the loose. Sagittarius, the letter G, someone's got hospice care, shady ex friend putting a planning on you, for real, for real. Someone don't like you, and well, I'm glad we're all having fun. Karma could be coming in your direction, Capricorn. So why would karma come in Capricorn's direction? Yeah, you could have made a wish about getting around and marrying to make you more strong and abundant and better and all these things. Somebody let out some secrets, or you're holding some secrets, maybe about a new love. You don't want to gossip on this situation, you feel like you made a bridge to get to somebody, but you know it's going to come out public. This person could be a man who dresses as a woman, that's a man cover, that's a woman. You hoping for longevity in this, you're feeling guided by the stars. Yeah, maybe, maybe, and maybe this could be a king of swords, and maybe their wife's watching. Or maybe you saw a king of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, yeah. Somebody would leave somebody else in the cold and go and meet somebody. And maybe this made you feel strong, this five of swords. Maybe you felt more powerful and not so much in your head. Maybe you bonded with this person, but other people have seen you. Somebody videoed you doing something, Capricorn. Be very careful, yeah. Could have been with a king of wands, Leo, Aries or Sagittarius. Normally my Leo cards. Someone also could be drugging you, so you wouldn't even know what you're doing when you're doing it because you're not really there. Could be getting your old suspenders on, getting all your sexy nicks on. Yeah, you could have a Leo's cat with you for some reason. Somebody could be trying to message someone and screwing up all the messages afterwards. Yeah, you could also be hoping on a Ten of Cups relationship. And somebody else, you could have another man who's watching you. Maybe that's your man, your original man. Yeah, that husband, that jealous one. <laughs> who's being guided towards something. Maybe they're being guided towards something they saw. Maybe they saw a letter. Maybe they got a key. Oh yeah, Leo's holding something. Something's repetitive, though. Something's not stopping, is it, Capricorn? You're not ending something. You're repeating it. You're causing arguments. Maybe you're being very cunning at this time. Maybe you're caught up in karma. Also, could be some dodgy money going on. Someone could be a snake and somebody's got two doors to go down. What they don't realise is they're in a maze with lots of other people. Yeah, you think this is your anchor, but actually it's a very, very, very loose dream, really. You could be very loyal to someone. You could be thinking of commitment and psychically thinking you're going to get a new beginning in a relationship. If you've got your magnifying glass, you'd realise... There's probably a lot of children in this situation. There's probably a lot of new births in this situation. Maybe you're one of them and someone just likes people to be isolated. 
on call for them and everybody else. <laughs> yeah. Three dicks at the same time. Let me just turn that tail off. Yeah, Capricorn. Glass of Wigan. My days with people really loving on themselves, and this person spitting venom on you. They tried to make you a fool. Maybe you knew, maybe you didn't. October's relevant, Jehovah's Witness. Nighttime lurking, Leo Moon. Life will never be the same again. Some of the White Witch, Capricorn Ascendant, Egyptian Sun God. And this person wants to leave. Somebody wants to leave this situation there, Capricorn. I don't think it's you because I think we're too spellbound to be uh, leaving this situation. Yeah, you've got too much temptation going on. Maybe you're seeing something because you're a star. Maybe you're uh, quite addicted to a situation. Yeah, you're not making a decision between two. You've got something that you hold very hard, but you've also got something you're looking at. Yeah, you could be... Having an Aries coming in towards you, offering you love, offering you fire sign, offering you love. And yeah, someone who's just got no emotions, they're out of them, their emotions completely. And you could be going in with a very long stick, even apologising to this person. Maybe you had passionate, fiery messages with this person. There you are, Capricorn. You could be you, could be another Capricorn, uh, Virgo or Taurus. You could also be dealing with an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. She could have an older woman who's very psychic who's watching the situation. She's also got her bird watching the situation. Yeah. She could be in high priestess mode. She could be keeping secrets for you at this time, Capricorn. Yeah. But she could even be. Yeah. She might even be telling people you're trying to heal. There definitely could be a very big Taurus or Capricorn involved in the situation. You could be married to someone as well. Someone you're ignoring, you could be ignoring someone you're married to because of sneaky behaviour. Someone could have sp spiritually attacked you as well, they could have control over your mind. You could have lots of options as well, but look, it's like an eagle's, it's like a bird's feet attached to her there, yeah. Having to guard and protect yourself because someone's about to bring down your tower. A Leo could have warned you about this. There's some apples there, Leo's howling, and there's dark en energy down there. That could be a Virgo. Because the hermit card's a Virgo, somebody who shuts the door but leaves the quick keys on the door for you. Or they ask you to do that for them. Yeah. Somebody who prowls around waiting for their ships to come in because they're always looking for recognition and reward in all situations. This person could call you or text you a lot. Um, yeah, and you could be thinking they're your blessing. You could be seeing them games, you know, big rings. Yeah. You could also be getting messages from this person. You could be thinking this person is your soulmate. You could be aching with love, yeah, wanting to have a new beginning. Yeah, you could get a message from a very snotty fire sign who walked away. Um, maybe you've been enlightened to something. Maybe you were told something. Maybe about the three of them, about heartbreak, about being stabbed in the back. Maybe you need to go off and do a bit of soul searching. Corn. Yeah, because you're blindfolding yourself to truth at the moment. You need to shed your skin with the five of uh, five of pentacles. Normally being left out in the cold, but it's not in that one. It's shedding the skin. It's shedding an old skin. Some lesson you're being taught, Capricorn. Yeah, and that could be to do with the Queen of Pentacles. That's you. Yeah, you could be getting wise. Um, you could become a teacher. You could turn metal into gold eventually. Could become an alchemist with somebody, maybe you already were. Maybe somebody has a choice between two lovers. Maybe you've got, yeah, maybe that person has other women. Um, yeah, and you and this person could cause murder and bloodshed and tell her things to come and the cause of love or friends or enemies. You could be making people invincible, making them go bang. Yeah, temperance, balance. Someone could be making great noise while they bring in some balance. Yeah, and that could be someone who had a new beginning with passion mate. Could be telling holy secrets and instructing them how to make weapons in seduction. This person could be yeah, in the art of seduction. They could be quite high up. They could have lots of people they 
put under this induction spell. Ten of Pentacles, yeah. And this person could also understand the Tongue of Elements and can uncover a treasure hidden by magicians. This person could be an alchemist. Yeah, you could have thought you could have won against this person. But no, probably not. As they teach in astrology and liberal sciences, they reveal hidden treasure and bring extra. They can also take hidden treasure, yeah. And we've got Leo here with my Queen of Wands. And she can tell anyone anything anyone desires to know, gives dignities, and can make any man, anyone subject to demands with this good familiars. Hmm, Six of Swords. Someone can travel all over the world in a second and give somebody good astral project, maybe. Somebody has lots of new beginnings in love, though, and yeah, bring good familiars to people. The Wheel of Fortune is turning, right? And hidden treasure and all things of that are, are, are hidden danger are going to be revealed. Capricorn. Time is up on that situation. Yeah, big earthquakes are going to happen. Politicians or clergymen return those who have run away. Anybody who's run away will have to come back. You can't run away from this situation anymore because it's out there. The strong and faithful fighter follows all commands and answers all questions. Yeah, and then someone's going to bring back souls from the dead and make them answer these questions. And it's going to tell of a past, present and future and build love between friends and enemies. High priestess, they know secret thoughts of all and can change them and cause love. Shows a vision of the world. Somebody's tried to bring this out and somebody shut them down maybe. Somebody lied there. Someone could also be lying about a child, somebody could be pregnant. This could all be about money. Illuminati could be involved. Someone needs to learn to think for themselves. An earth angel could be here. And lying going you to ruin your reputation. Well, you knew the ending was coming, just didn't know it was this one. Someone's on twins. September could be relevant. And someone's getting caught. And yeah, maybe even by your sister. Taurus Ascendant, Leo Ascendant. Yeah, body location with the ability to be in the same two places at the same time. December's relevant, cancer, ascendant, sexual tension and ecstasy. Someone's smile going to disappear from their face pretty shortly and an unknown number may be calling me Capricorn. So who is this? Yeah, you're not going to get any partnership in your life with where you are. I feel like you feel like you maybe you should be getting a victory and success. Love won't begin here. And you won't be able to move on because it's karma. Yeah. And you won't be getting any prosperity either. Capricorn. Um, do some of those. Find out where you are, where you've got lost. Yeah. In a blessing. In something you think is a blessing. What's up with this blessing? Yeah, Capricorn has a new idea. You went to find peace. Maybe you didn't have peace in your situation. You wanted comfort. Maybe you wanted someone to give you some attention. Yeah, you sure you're on the right path, love? And trust your gut feeling. Someone married for money. Someone's acting like they're in puberty. Yeah, move differently now and let them carry on because this is going to bite back. They ain't loyal to their own. Um, Self-worth, abandonment issues. Maybe you're suffering from abandonment issues. Maybe somebody's abandoned you. Yeah, you'll be feeling a bit of sadness, great sadness. Maybe on something that you thought should be abundant, but it's causing you heartache. Maybe you went on a journey. Maybe you crossed a Leo. Maybe you're with a Leo. There's no hope in this situation there. And there's no support in this situation, yeah. Maybe you need to balance your life up, get integrity. It could be a Libra involved. Somebody went, maybe you wanted recognition, but you ended up being isolated with choices and a player. Knight of Wands, a cheater. Yeah. So you won't get comfort in this situation. Yeah. It'll be like the past, but it's another, whatever you left, whatever you've got. Somebody could be having two tw twins as well as two dolphins there. Yeah, there could be a lot of determination in this situation. You could also have a cancer Pisces, a Scorpio coming in to want commitment, but you're not going to put an end to that with loss, yeah. You've not got any more dedication to that situation, and you feel the wheel of fortune isn't turning in your 
in your for your victory basically. Yeah, you could be manifesting at this time, you could be manifesting an Aries, a Leo could be around you and you could be juggling. Yeah, you could be tested at the moment for something. Yeah, and indifference. You need to speak your truth, Capricorn. To have luck on your side, to change your fortune, to gain wisdom as well in a situation. And so you can celebrate and end this drama and these departures out of your life because trust they are. People are, it's, people are going to depart your life so you can heal. You know, you've got lots of challenges coming up and you need to progress forward. Yeah. And you've got Leo again. Leo has something to do with your happiness, yeah, because you've got a lot of uncertainty around that, some decisions you made, maybe you broke free, maybe you took action in a situation and had inspiration, maybe with a wand, maybe somebody got a wand out for you, yeah, maybe you're thinking it's a blessing at the moment, could be a Virgo Taurus or Capricorn, somebody who's very generous or you feel they're very generous, yeah, you feel it could be very spiritual, as all those before you. <laughs> Yeah, bitches could be involved with their pee. Pisces moon, someone took a dip, no washing involved. That could be a Virgo sun. Planning on kidnap and police brutality. Poor life choices. HR and third house. Gemini could be involved. Gemini could be relevant. You're about to go and say in the membrane, no, or somebody is. Plant seeds in your head, love and heal yourself, Capricorn. Someone's got herpes. Someone's got AIDS, someone's got herpes, you need to watch yourself. Yeah, and they thought you didn't know, Jake's on them. Did you know, though, Capricorn? August 10th has. Catch you, Capricorn. You're doing this to your own blood. This is a really bad idea, Capricorn. When the door shuts, it's locked, no fair. Yeah, don't reopen. And it's already locked, so I'd be unlucky and why. Yeah, because someone was working with a moon cycle. Somebody thought they were clever. Somebody thought they could get one over on someone. Someone's a twisted bitch, basically. Yeah. Time's ticking on the situation. Tick tock, tick tock. Cancer moon, automatic writing, walking out of the door. Mars could be relevant. Scorpio, Aries. Assertion, aggression, war, fire. You could be going into war with somebody and they've got a whole lot of people involved in this. Whole lot of people they sleep with Capricorn, whole lot of diseases they saw. Scorpio, power, abuse, birth, death, taboo, occult, Venus, Taurus, Libra, Virgo, love, lust, Aquarius, descendant. Shit's gonna hit the fan very soon. Someone could have been doing divination. A sibling could be hating on you with others. The letter L. Heard it all before. Capricorn, moon, sun, that's a Leo. You've got lots of Leo in this reading. Someone's in trouble with the police, seems like a canary, another woman, your sister, cousin, a friend could be involved. Scorpio, so multiple stab wounds, and why? Because someone's, someone's bugged somebody's house and listening to everything they say, that could be your other partner, they could be knowing a lot, and this person could be talking to shit with people you know, someone could be clairvoyant, win at all costs, locked door, salty surprise, Freemason, X, and Q, and A, and on crazy shit again. Path, North Node. Somebody could find some naked pictures of you that you sent to somebody that you never wiped off something. Yeah, that could affect your heart chakra. Just need to find light in the situation. Someone's definitely showing you their shadow. You could be thinking this is balance. You could be thinking this is a twin flame relationship. You need to open your third eye. Someone's blocked it. Yeah, you're not growing a firm, firm foundation. Yeah, you may think you put patience and planning, but you, yeah, you may have ended up getting yourself, yeah, in trouble. You could be pregnant, and there could be deception and envy over the situation. Maybe you got pregnant with the wrong one. Yeah, you could have to make sacrifices as well because you're gonna have obstacles and challenges, and accelerated motion. Yeah, could have what triumph. There's a big red flag there, Capricorn. If you didn't notice. Gonna cause you a lot of heartache and loss. You need to talk to someone, you need to open up about the situation. Yeah, you can't just hide it, don't go away. Material and spiritual prospects come out of this emotional withdrawal. Hear your base chakra. Yeah, find hope in this situation. Stand your ground, know what you want and what you don't want. If you want the child, if you don't want the child, make a transformation. Emotional loss. Yeah. You can feel something's a spiritual union and want triumph and success. And here you're, you're going to come into some wisdom about some mental conflict. Someone has a lot of temptation. 
Someone could have addictions, yeah. And someone leaves people behind with memories of love. It could be an Aries, someone with Aries in their chart, someone just thinks they're the boss. Yeah, material harvest. Um, yeah, choice between two lovers. Yeah, you could have a Queen of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. That could have been your love. You could have had a new beginning in love. You could have had a lot of love for that person, but maybe you had an ending there because of a tower moment. And a complete ending in the situation, maybe because of a Virgo Hermit card, yeah. Um, there was an end of a cycle. And then there's you, Capricorn, the devil. Maybe you took freedom from that. Maybe you went towards somebody who's got... Uh, maybe you went towards a fire sign, Aries Leo, or Sagittarius. Somebody with that in their chart. Maybe they caused you restrictions. Maybe you're a very generous person. Maybe you're giving far too much money. And maybe this person holds a lot of secrets. Maybe you knew they did, yeah, use your crown chakra, yeah, you want to have a new beginning, uh, and then the card of Leo, power, you need to take your power back, Capricorn, because you could not realise that you've lost it, yeah, this person could blame you from childhood, or you blame somebody from childhood, and what actually is real in the morning, nothing, few trust with friends, one enemy, made a grass on you to the police, and they want to get even dead or alive. Yeah, you still watching us still talking. Taurus meme could be relevant. And I'm going to leave it there, I think. Yeah, open your third eye shut. You need to see that. Police could be involved in this situation. A whole lot of people could be. Brother or sister working with this person to bring you down. Or well, you're doing that. Heavy dark candle magic. Paranormal activity. Move on. Go to the north. <laughs> the letter N. And now these people are not so happy. Don't sleep with this person. I've got an STD, Capricorn. If you have already, get checked. Especially if you're pregnant. The letter T, bad bitch antics, nay. Black dark thoughts, control freak. They even like the same sex. They sleep with a lot of different people. They're lying to themselves. Yeah, lie, lie, well. Somebody about the blue eyed girl not being quite so blue eyed. Yeah. I'm afraid there's no more filter and standard. I'm just reading cards. Take care of your financial needs before everyone, this person spends it all. Yeah, these people are wishing and wanting death or an accident. Someone's a hoax. Yeah. Astral projecting your dreams. Someone's fucked up big time in trouble now. And someone's getting a big shock. Yeah. I'm going to leave it there. Yeah. Someone's got a foul mouth. Childhood issues. And secrets. Are out, lights are on, Capricorn. People know about this. People are watching, watching, watching. How dumb are you? This person makes people stop trusting you. Like Neptune could be relevant, they could be drugging you, putting you under illusions, making you feel things that you don't feel. Someone could be married, someone who's married is about to get caught. Fake ass apology ain't gonna work, and leaving their kids at home alone. Someone's trying to drug you, said so away. Let us see it and fraud all around the situation. This person could be videoing you, you're selling them videos. Someone lost a court case, a windmill full of corpses, and you look way too good to be fucking that. Someone's a magician, and this man acts like the biggest bitch. He acts like a boy, actually, or a sassy white woman could be involved. Aries Moon, and yeah, doppelganger. They're like, keep K, K could be a doppelganger, and Karma, a sweet man, family member, close friend, cousin trying to cause a fatal accident. A snake, you're missing something. Car issues, and this person's gone totally insane with all the magic they're doing. And somebody is not the father of the child, and you're not going to be able to make them either. It's going to be blatantly obvious. You're profoundly clairvoyant, big setup, and telepathy. Yeah, police are under cover watching the situation. And ex family go, man. Maybe you were going behind somebody's back for seven months with this person as well. Coven has been formed and a legal meaning. Children are involved and a group plotting to really hurt you. Base that's that. And this hate is a lot bigger than you think. Shield yourself, Capricorn. Yeah. Someone's dying and exactly what you expect. Falling down all the way. South node, the letter J. People really need to grow up. Not today, thank you. And you ain't being your slip. Someone ain't going to be your sloppy seconds. Free yourself. And they're all trying to fuck you up. Hopefully you know that. Yeah, the letter V. Moving on swiftly. Wear a mask. Illusion. What happens when the spell ends? Someone's a starseed light worker. And someone's on sofa full of fucked up freaks. Libra, Sun and Mars. 
listen to your intuition, Capricorn, when it comes back and run. Yeah, and this person hurts themselves for attention. And yeah, solving problems with violence. Someone's going to go batshit crazy, that's what I reckon. <laughs> anyway, three to two. Well, there's a whole lot of cards there, Capricorn. Yeah, just be yourself, you're great. Uh, learn family culture. You have a special bond with a grandparent, one in a million, teamwork with others. And someone's coming back from the past, and that could be karmic. Keep learning, self improvement is the key. And start today and don't put it off. Right, love and light, Capricorn, I'll leave you there. Take care of yourselves. Bye bye.